Hello everybody, welcome back to Hermitcraft. Uh, Tortuga is a little bit different to the last time you saw it, so let's uh, let's take just a, a quick look around. So I'm going to start at the docks. Um, I decided I didn't like... Hi, X. I, 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 I mean, I'm assuming it's X. It seems like an X thing to do. Um, he's just walked on, by the way, onto the server. So, um... Yeah, I've changed the docks because I don't like half slabs because docks feel like they should be thin. So I've started putting down like the spruce planks. I do like spruce planks as a as a building material. Um, it affects what can go on them. Um, but I figure if I just remove things for half slabs and then we can just go from there, really, it'll be fine. Um, what else? Okay, yes, I've decided that um, we need a little bit of... Ignore the, the pods all. I've, I've obviously been growing spruce trees because of, I needed a lot of spruce wood. I've done a little pathway down to the fountain and it'll go around here somewhere. I feel like the fountain should be over a bit, but you know what, it's fine. And then I've done sort of like, like these little walkways over here and I'm going to have them attached to tops of buildings over here and then there's going to be sort of like an... Oh yeah, and I buried my cows and my sheep. So, uh, that's where they are, in case you were wondering. <laughs> and obviously I put, um, vines here. And yeah, so it, I, I wanted it sort of like to follow the lay of the land, more or less. Um, that one, and, and to have these, these dark oak fences, really, it's fine. Um, I do know that there is, <sighs> that needs to have a stair there. Can't afford stairs. Can't afford to court stairs at the moment, but we'll sort it out. Um, yes, a lot of the a lot of the hermits came along on our last server meeting, and said, "Oh, I like your build," and I'm like, "Thanks." So <laughs> that was nice to hear. Um, yes, I also know that the sun's going down. Um, I also know that X has put in a request for me to do some stuff with tag server. Was meant to do it earlier in the week, but as you can possibly tell by the slightly nasally experience, I am sick. Um, those of you new to my channel, this happens a lot. You'll get used to it. Um, I guess I should go over to the district. Um, but uh, I think bed first. Bed first. Oh. Right, let's start off with something that I know that's happened. So we've got here at the, uh, the post office with... I need that cow head. I need that cow head. I need a cow head. Any cow head. Apparently I've got a mailbox. Um... Is it under clear or zombie? It's under zombie clear. Thank you. So. Lol, you've been jingled. No mail. Squid Ink. Now open in town. I, Jevin, sweet treats. Now open. We'll go have a look at those because I've not looked at those yet. Across to Cleo. Uh, thanks, Joe. Across to Cleo. Right. Zany, oceanic, maniacal. Maniacal? Okay. That's true. Uh, builder, intrepidly enterprising, coastally lawless ever onwards. Thanks for the acrostic poem, Joe. I, I appreciate it. Um, I shall put it in my bookcase that doesn't exist. It's fine. Um, which way am I going? Ooh, shiny tree. Uh, I can't remember which way to town. Poo. All right, I know what this is, but I can't help think that it's... Hideous. Spoilers behind this wall. This chest is for Mumbo. Con Yelp shop review. Minus three out of ten stars. Spoilers, spoilers, spoilers. Yeah, if you go in and you spoil the shop, you, you have to get fined for it. Ah, I didn't go in. Sucks to be you. Um, so yes, I know that there's... Oh, I should have left most. Oh, no, I can, I can, I can get some space. It's fine. I leave requests in the book. Request by Shishwam, Shish, Shishwami. Um, okay. The Hermitcraft tag building requires three murals commemorating memorable moments in the tag game's history. At Tag HQ, there are three mural... Muriel? Muriel? <laughs> okay, 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 X, that's fine. Muriel, Muriel <laughs> locations in the lobby. I'll provide any supplies needed and pay handsomely. Okay. Um, question is, where is... At Tag HQ. Where is Tag HQ? Okay, I need to look that up. That's fine. And I, Jevon, I know what this is because he's he's already spoken to me about it. It's fine. Uh, re request, teach me your masterful ways of the stands, Jevon. And I've got money in there from Jevon. Okay, so that's fine. Okay, so I need to organise a time with... Ooh. 
Jevin's sweet treats. Let's have a look. One pumpkin pie, one diamond, free sample of cake, four candy apples, one caramel apple, one diamond, ah, one cake, one diamond, 16 cookies and one milk. I approve. I like the Neapolitan ice cream theme. It's good. I likes. I likes. I approve. You 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 win cookies. Oh no, well, maybe I win cookies. Maybe maybe, maybe that's a thing. Um and then there's this which this giant quill glass bottle thing I believe is Falses Ink Shop, which I have seen before now that I think about it. I just haven't gone in because it's not registered because my brain is like Why? Why is there a phantom? I don't know why there's a phantom. Entrance. Oh, 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 okay, well. Could I not just. Okay, that's terrifying. I'm, I'm out of here. I am out. Um, I also know that Grian's uh, stand has gone. It's probably been shot by a skeleton. Apparently I'm being chased by a phantom somehow. Um, I will come and sort that back out. I can't afford another godhead, but um, I will. I'll, I'll pose the stand for him, so that's fine. Um, and he can supply his own godhead because they're really easy to get with a looting three sword. What's going on over here? Seriously, what's what's this? Public. Bugs be gone notice. This site is contaminated. Fumigation in process. Do not enter. I feel somebody's... I, I feel like log fellas are back somehow. Just a hunch. It's just a thought. Ah! I always suck at that. Actually, I don't. I don't know what happened there, but... um, Well, I failed, obviously. There we go. That's much better. Oh, and people were sort of like, I don't know where all the coordinates to my base are because I'm drawing a map. Um, whoever that guy is, the shopping district there. I'm here. That's, that's fine. Um, this little river crossing here and they put me over on the other side of the river and it's not. And people wanted me to go ooh over this. And I do like this. This is cool. Um, I, I'm... The geologist in me is impressed. Let's put it out like that. And yeah. Anyway, let's let's go back to to base, get some armor stands, and then head to wherever X wants me to do the thing. Um, I'm not entirely sure what X wants. Well, I found it. Um, let's have a look and see what's going on. It is beautiful, by the way. Let's let's just land and admire for a minute. That is, that is pretty awesome, actually. <laughs> well done, X. I approve. You did a good. It's nice, a, a nice little fantasy build in the fantasy district. Ow. All right, let's go in. So the tag building. Ooh. Don't know what that is. That looks cool. And so like little armor stands. All right, read donations. Mule three. Tango spies on the convex. Uh, mural one. Mumbo tags green with redstone. Uh, mural two. Cub swoops in from the sky. Uh, on Izuma. Okay, right. That's going to be tricky. Because I have to sort out the legs. Tango spies on convex. Hmm. All right. This is entirely doable. I need to go and look up these things. What's down here? I need to go down into the depths. Ooh. Well, maybe I don't. Oh, hang on, I've got, I've got I've got my armor on. It's fine. Go away. I don't know what's down here or why it's down here, but it's fine. Hall of Tag is under construction. Exit ahead. Okay. That's fine. Oh, I'll take all of those. Right. So... I need to go and read. I need to go and do my research is what we're saying here. Um, which is fine. I can do research. I also need to... I mean, this place is really close by my house. So I'm not suggesting anything, but, you know, just saying. Um, 
Okay, so yeah, Force's base is here. And it goes sort of out here, and my house is like... Yeah, so yeah, basically, I just have to follow the minarets from Force's base to get back home. Okay, I need to think about this a little bit more. I'm going to go hide on my ship, because I can. Right. And now I need to figure out how this is going to work. All right, first things first, I've got to test is... Can armor stands wear elytra? They can. Okay, that it makes makes my life a little bit more easy and also my elytra. Um, so I need a shopping list of things I can give to X because I've I've gone and looked up like some of the tag videos. I mean, I looked up the green redstone one, which was quite funny. Um, I haven't found the the tango spies on the convex once. So I'm going to have to go and look that one up too. Uh-huh. Okay, Jevon. You're heading to the tag video now because you got tagged last season. I am literally the only person on the server right now, apart from X, who is AFK. No, 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 no. Right, yep, okay, yep. Oh, I see. Hiding. I was going to offer to, to help him do, like, redstone stuff, but no. <laughs> I feel like I should get the hell out of Dodge right now, because that would be... <laughs> because that would be, like... I'm now nervous, because... Uh... <laughs> that is a thing that... Oh dear. I need to work on the thing I said I was going to work on though. That's a pain in the bum. I have looked at all the videos though. I know what I'm doing. Um, I need to work on it though. When it... Just... Uh, I just... Um, um, uh, oh now, now, now this is worrying. <laughs> This is worrying. Okay, right. Um, hmm. Hmm. Okay, right. Well, first things first. Let's just, uh, let's just avoid everything and, uh, not pay. <laughs> yeah, this is, this is anxiety ridden. <laughs> All right, I'm admitting this is risky that he's going to the tag building, but I feel like it. The tag should. Oh, let's uh, let's just uh, let's just keep quiet over here. Let's just make sure that Jev is not in there. Why do I feel like he's going to be stalking me now? Okay, let's see if he's been and gone. Read donations. Oh, I've forgotten how to read these books. Come on. Okay. Oh. Okay, it's not there. Right. Um. Oh. Rude. Okay, let's just have a quick look. There's the hall up here, and let's just double check he's just gone. You must undertake this ritual before the play the game of tag. Jump through towers high, take a leap of faith. But first must one must be punished and take the walk of shame. Okay, I, I am I am not tagged. I cannot take the walk of shame because I have not been tagged. Goodness. Right, okay. So Muriel <laughs> Mumbo tags Greer with redstone. Okay, I've got actually a picture of this, so I can actually just sort of set up the little machinery that was used. So yeah, oh he's put down a, a thing. Okay. That one is going to require cub sweeping in, and I'm gonna have him sweeping in from up here and just have X so I heard it. You all heard it.
You all heard that, right? Change of plan, leg it. Oh crap, no, 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 no. Change of plan, just cheese it, it's fine. I'm, I'm out of here. No, 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 no. Absolutely not. I am not being tagged, no. It's just not happening. Okay, I'm, I'm out. I'm going to the shopping district to, to bide my time. Oh, and Jeff's also asked me to do a thing with him, so... Mm. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Nope. Nope, nope. I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> oh, there's an X. And he's doing heads for me because we agreed that before we can sort stuff out, he's going to do heads and, and all sorts of things. So he's making hermit heads. And yeah, he's doing like command block stuff. Oh, look, he's got like a green head and a mumbo head. And what do we need? Needs a cub head and an X head. And tango head and two convexes excellent i'm just just gonna sit here and wait oh look there's the tango head just gonna say it's fine uh, zuma has uh got to change his skin because he's got a different skin on i could just put a turtle head in and it'd be the same thing it really would Okay, so let's start with, ooh, probably the easiest one to do. So I've got all the heads in here that X has given me. I've also got like some backup stuff that I can use to make things. And I need to probably get a chest and all that sort of gubbins going. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go get some wood from, from my base because I should have done that already. Can I just point out how awesome a build of force is? Just, just saying. We all knew it. And just, I'm just putting it out there. It's just awesome. All right. So I've done Mumbo's little contraption where Green steps on the pressure plate. It, it makes the thing go and he gets smacked and he doesn't realize until he's got the thing, blah, 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 blah. I'm not going to put the pressure plate on because I want them to know that that's there so i need to make a green statue just just sort of being pushed off here so i'm just going to put him there for the moment and then i'm going to have to pose him and then i want kind of like a mumbo because mumbo is sort of looking from this direction so i'm going to have him sort of like afk over here because that's basically what happened i mean he was more sort of like over I'm looking at my picture, he's more sort of like over here, but you know, I, I do what I can with the best of my abilities. I don't know if I should have that activated or not. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to take that out. I'm going to have this whole thing activated. So I need a cobble and a stick. I've got wood. I've got wood. Don't quote that, please. Okay, so we've got... Surprised Green Head statue. So where's Green? Green, Green, right. So he's sort of shocked. And do I want him jumping? I think I want him jumping. So I've taken off gravity. So just jumping in surprise. Just like, what the heck? Do I move him forward? Maybe. I think it's this one. No, wrong one. But you know what? That's never a bad thing. It's the exposition. Maybe in the other direction. Okay, this book is fin finicky. So people want my advice. Just, um, it's, it's tricky. Just keep fiddling until it works. And what I really want is I want like a little armor stand with a not name tag. I don't have any name tags. I'm going to have to figure it out somehow. Hi, Ren. Hi. Going to the same place, possibly. I want rockets. Ah, oh, there are rockets. Two stacks for one diamond. Excellent. Oh, hi. 
I need to take like one, two, three, four, five, six stacks. Oh, he's just put nothing like a bit of casual afternoon noon shopping. Don't tell Jevon where you are. It's a secret. And I'm just going to go in behind the locked door. It's fine. It's fine. Nothing bad's going to happen to me. It's fine. I should probably put some of these rockets away. I don't need all of them. Like, at all. You know what? I need to get myself an ender chest, really. Alright, so I've been in here a while. So I've got, like, th I've, I've spent some money. Got some potatoes. That's a really good business model, by the way. Just so we know. Um, yeah. I, I need to take this stuff back with me. But, and that. That I definitely need. That is a thing that is definitely needed in this position. But the rest of that I can probably just leave. Um, yeah, so I've got some potatoes. I've bought four diamond chest plates. Um, I also need some trousers. I need leather trousers. So... I'm going to have a look at the... Uh, uh, the skelly farm. See if they've got any leather trousers. I need, like, a lot. Yeah, I nipped to get some uh, shulker boxes from the rocket shop. And I've also got a whole bunch of, like, leather armor and stuff that I can use. So it should be, all in all, a good day. Oh, there's someone flying in the sky. Don't know who that was, but uh, I mistook it for a phantom and then I realized it was daytime. So, yeah, I'm hoping... I don't know how they they, they managed to fly, because I can't fly. It's because Mumbo's on the server. <laughs> Love you, Mumbo, but seriously, I can't fly when Mumbo's on. That's why I'm walking. That's why I'm walking. Hopefully that was Jevon looking for me and, and not finding me. That would be fine. I'm quite happy to, to avoid Jevon, because now I'm paranoid. So, uh, not that I wasn't paranoid before. But it's not paranoia if they are out to get you. So I've done a little mumbo pose. However, I do think his head needs to go sort of in the other direction. I think it's... A, no, no. It is a Z, but it's not that Z. I think he needs to sort of tilt his head sideways to sort of like avoid, you know, looking exactly like... Right, so I've got him there. That's him AFK. I've also got him... No. The, right, it's just... I don't, right, before you have a go, I don't have, like, non-enchanted leather gear because my cow farm isn't exactly, like, a proper cow farm. Right, so, that's that. Mumbo's sort of, like, their AFK. Right, let's, let's, well, I would seal it if I was in creative and it would not move. Now, down here, what I want, I'm going to have to do it this way, is I'm going to have to check that target. Yep, it's that one. Okay, show arms. Right, and I want to give it a name tag. There you go, have a name tag. Can you not? I know you can hold this, don't even front. Okay, this is weird. Apparently, armor stands cannot hold name tags. I did not know that. I didn't know that. Um, hmm. Show arms, yes. You got the arms, but cannot do name tags. Okay, so what I think is happening here, and I'm going to be <laughs> bit irritated because you can name armor stands in this in this this uh, thing. You can't put armor stands in their arms. I think that's what's happening. I could be wrong. I've been wrong before, but I cannot. I just bought three bloody name tags without... Okay, I guess I'm naming things then. I should name a parrot. Um, yeah, so because you can't name them, so I... Hmm. There's nothing that particularly looks like a name tag, so I can't substitute it for anything. That's a blow. Ooh, ooh, little bit annoyed. Actually, I'm not really annoyed. Um, I could name them. I'm not going to because then I'd have to name all of them. And I don't have the money. Does someone own a donkey? No. I'd quite like a donkey. Um, anyway, yes. 
that's what's going on there. So never mind. Tell you what I am going to do. I am going to put the uh, name tag in the dispenser. Um, I should name it tag your rich, shouldn't I? I don't have my... You know what? You're just going to have to deal with it. Just unnamed. It's just a name tag in there. So yeah, that's fine. So yeah, I've just had it um, confirmed by the owner of the mod pack that... Um, mod pack? It's not even a mod pack. It's not even a mod. Uh, the person who made the armor stand booklet. Um, yes, they've just... There. That's pushed, by the way. Hello, Pushbok. Um, yes, they have confirmed that uh, that is the case, that armor stands will not hold armor tags because they name them. That's true. I I'm glad I figured it out. There you go. Since I have my diamonds, I'll... I'll because he was carrying... Tango was carrying a pickaxe at this particular time. And that's what he tagged him with. He was holding a pickaxe. I stand by my my thing. And I put the gold blocks there. Because then for some reason... That's what stood out to me when I watched this clip. When we were all... We were all basically Tango sneaking around back here. Watching what was going on. And so yeah. He came around and he... I, I should put some... Ah, I should put some redstone down. Because that's what he just... Oh, I know what I can do. Where's the redstone? I actually took a bunch of redstone. Did I leave the redstone behind? Oh, no. Right, so I've got a tiny bit of uh, armor stand holding that redstone. So I'm going to make that target visible, invisible. Right, so that's just sort of hovering around. Can't get it any lower than that. Hang on, I might be able to if I move the right hand. Ooh, I hadn't thought about actually moving the right hand down. It's going to make it a bit... Yeah, it just tilts it slightly okay well there we go he's broken the redstone he's going up here and now i need to do is it cub that he hit i'm pretty sure it's cub that he hit oh i hate creepers i hate them so much i spent ages on that i just got blown up by a by a buggering creeper okay fine i just need to refix everything um be fair though it just seems to be stone brick stairs that were the out oh, and the uh, tango arm stand um let's just no take that back let's just seal this arm stand sorry lock it can't seal it poo okay i've sealed it off as best as i can whilst i'm working that is a pain in the bum okay so i need like like two of those to make stairs Ugh. Well, at least it was only one stand, and I do I did get the uh, the stuff back, so it's not terrible. It's just it's just bad, and I'm sad now. There we go. We've got the uh, spy cam uh, Tango versus Cub and Scar on the thing, and he's down there. And there's uh, for, uh, for some reason the gold blocks stick in my mind. Just they do. All right, this next one is going to be tricky because I don't actually think there is... It's going to be this one. Yeah. Um, I don't actually think there is a, a way to lie down. No, that's a stargazing. Um, yeah, because what's what I need to happen is I need to have... Invisible armor stands entirely for this. Um, so the arm's going to not be there. But I also need him just sort of flying in. So there's actually going to be four armor stands here. Um, <laughs> that's not going to be easy. Yeah, so there's going to be four armor stands. And they're all to make up one flying lunatic. <laughs> Let's be honest about it. One flying lunatic swooping down. Um, I'm going to have to give the illusion of arms because arms are going to be impossible with this. So I'm going to get started. Um, yeah, this one's going to be hard. All right, you see what a monster I've created already? So I'm going to need to have... Oh, I can possibly put the head on this one as well. Um, if I can get the head angled properly and I can move the arms properly. Um, I'm going to have to make it invisible because the legs I can't... Because the legs don't move 
independently of the body. So I'm going to have to make some another pair of legs and lift them next to the body and make an elytra and somehow position that against this body. So, yeah, that's what I'm working on right now. Mother, help me. Uh, sorry, there's a very Frankenstein-y feel to this. Right, so I have... Yeah, it's that one. Um, apply gravity, no. Right, so now we've got to start lifting this one up into the air and positioning it how I want. So, Y plus five. Up we go. This is the weirdest one I think I've ever done. And I think it's going to have to... <laughs> oh my God, what have I done? Okay, well, I guess... Now, then I need to... No, it needs to be higher than that. I need to be closer in, and it needs to be higher. Oh my giddy aunt. No? Oh, we're getting to the point where it's saying you're too low off the ground. Right, so... That's where that's got to be. And now I need to turn this invisible. Right, so... Uh, Cub, you're going to have no hands. However, I've only got one slash potion of slowness. I want that being thrown. Um, ghost cub is fine. Ghost cub is fine. I'm wondering how this is going to work. Okay. Um, I might have to... Right, okay. Come on up then. Did I apply gravity? No. Right, let's go. Um, let's bring it up to meet the rest of this monstrosity. I could have just built it up here and it would have been easier. But no, I'm special. This is the weirdest puzzle game I've ever played. Uh, right, make sure. We're, yeah, we're on this one. Okay, so I need to move this forwards oh that's towards me so i'm guessing that one's forwards oh no that's backwards okay right okay just um mm. i am weirded out by this it's significantly just so you can tell oh we're nearly there okay so oh i need to take that back a nudge just just so his hips aren't displaced. And I've got to move him. <laughs> what have I done to myself? Okay, right. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. No, I've got to bring it down a little bit. Just, just, it's fine. This is fine. This is what's meant to happen. And then bring it forward again. Okay. Right. Before I do anything else, how does that look? That's not bad. Okay, right. This step is now... No, don't make it visible. Make it invisible. There we go. Oh, look. If you put enough time and patience and, and stupidity into it... Uh, let's lock that one. I might have to unlock it later. Okay. Hey, he's flying! With no arms... Or falling with style. I need to give him an elytra. That's job C, maybe. If I just go up this way and just put like an elytra like here, like a stand here and then put the elytra on it and move the body. Right, so, oh, yeah, X gave me an elytra. He did. He did give me an elytra. There we go. So we're not using mine. Where's mine? Oh, God, where's mine? Oh, it's down here. That's mine. We're not using... Well, now I can get out. Great. I... I'm not a big fan of massive holes in the ground. Because of that reason, really. That's fine. Oh. Oh, that's irritating. Elytras don't obey the rules of bodies. Hmm.
what can I do here? I'm not sure there's actually anything I can do. Poop. Right, so after a big a big effort, uh, I might have to just use like a series of stone plates because apparently elytra don't operate under the laws of physics. Okay, I'm I'm doing the best I can with the materials that I have. So I've got like a little little elytra going on there. I'm going to do one on the other side. We all know that it's going to be moderately okay. Okay, so that's as good as I can get in elytra because apparently elytra do not go on stands. Actually, yes, that would be nice if someone could sleep. Please, please, please. Um, okay, right, so what have we got? We've got Cub with as good an elytra as I can give him. Um, I want X... Right, if X is going to be anywhere, he's going to be... I mean, uh, he's going to be sort of here-ish, so... No, he needs to be down here. I'm sorry, X. I know you built this like thing specially, so look, so I could just go, woo. No, it's coming in this way. So, yeah, so... X... This one, okay, so yes, arms. And um, we're gonna turn, he turn, he turn him, actually running away, I think. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Okay, so I need to just pose him in a kind of running away pose. Just, oh, no, not that was too far. And if I get him in a running away pose, like, no, go back. Running. Are you not running? Okay, could you, you run like I've asked? Oh no, maybe it's this one. There we go. So he's running. I'm going to. I need to put his head on. Okay, so we've got X running away from... God, my brain's gone, cub. And throwing his potion of slowness. Oh, I enjoyed that. I mean, I don't really have any other theming because that's the main thing. I am proud of the fake elytra. The fake Lytra, as, we, as we're going to call it. I do need to give X his spare Lytra back, though, um, and say thank you, because that's... That I, because I did not know Lytra did not work that way on armor stands, which is a pain in the bum. So, yeah, a fake Lytra out of, like, little plates of... Basically stone plates, aren't they? So, yeah, because Lytra don't work. Oh, I'm quite proud of this. Particularly this one. This one took so many armor stands. So that's that is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight armor stands on its own. Nine, ten. That that diorama is ten armor stands. This is one, two. That's just two regular armor stands. This is one, two, three, four over there. So ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16. That's 16 armor stands in total. I, I quite enjoyed this one. Okay, right. I'm actually going to call it an episode there because I've been Zombie Cleo. This has been... I was going to say it's The Sims. It's not The Sims. It's Hermitcraft. Class dismissed.